In this screencast, we're just going to look at the power equation for uh, belt drives. So when we have uh, a belt drive, we have a driving pulley and a driven pulley, and uh, we have the belt going around uh, the pulleys. So as this as this particular pulley turns, it's um, compressing this side of the belt, so the belt gets a bit slacker. And as the belt comes around here on this side, as this is pulling this way, it becomes a bit tighter. And um, call that the tight side. Okay. Uh, where the belt hits the pulley, this angle here, as it goes right around to where it comes off, we call that the lap angle. So we a large lap angle here and a smaller uh, lap angle uh, here on this on this pulley. If the belt is going to slip, it always slips off uh, the smaller pulley. Okay. So here we have our two belts. There's our lap angle, and there's our uh, second lap angle. And around this pulley, uh, there's a different intention. So we have. Um, in this case, we have a slack side, uh, T2, and a tight side, T1. So the difference in tension between this side of the belt and this side of the belt would be uh, T1 minus T2. So we have this difference in tension. So that's the tension is a force. So this tension, let's say, acting uh, at this point here. I just drop it. Okay, so let's say there's the tension. That tension is acting a distance or from the from the center of the pulley. Okay, so we have a force at a distance. So the force is T1 minus T2, so the difference in tension in the belt. The distance is the radius. And that gives us a torque. So force by distance is torque. So the torque in the pulley is T1 minus T2 turns on. Okay, so the Example of this one, uh, this is radius 1, so it's T1 minus T2 times radius 1. That's the torque of this pulley. Uh, but we saw the power was e is equal to torque times uh, omega. So uh, I can say instead of the torque here, I can say, well, I know the torque is T1 minus T2 times L1. I just multiply that by omega, and that gives me the power. So that's the equation for the power. Okay, we also saw that uh, omega r is equal to velocity. Yeah. So instead of saying omega r, we can also say uh, the velocity. So in summary, the power across a pulley um, using uh, belt drives is the difference in tension in the belts between the tight side and the slack side times the velocity of the belt or times omega times the radius of the belt.